And we've returned with Persona 5 Royal because fuck you. I don't know. I'm tired. I'm like, ugh. Once I get uh, some requests for mementos, I am like smooth ending the video. Probably going through the roof. You gotta hear this. This cute chick says she wants to go out with a phantom thief. But not you specifically, huh? Not surprised. It's a member of the opposite sex. I know since the Charlie Ryuji, damn. You don't gotta say it over text too. Damn. Uh, what in the world were you doing all today? And eh, girl talking LeBlanc are more like chatting and snacking, really. So she's completed the objective for today. Next is pr uh, practice of being out in front of people. Wait, what? You'll be fine. Takumi will be with you the whole time. We want to ease you into it, so your first test will be helping out LeBlanc. The only Takumi will be with you tomorrow, so good luck. Uh, leave it to me. Thanks for your help. Hey! You better you better make an effort tomorrow, Takumi. Please tell me I can actually do something or Okay. Who is available? Oh mother fuck mm. Both of you fuckers are available. Damn it, both of you are available. Oh yeah, I'm already marathoning edits. I've already edited up to Madarame's Palace. Moments of time. I don't know why I went to that. Alright, so we need... Actually, what's Yusuke's bottom level? I just rest. Oh. Okay, so I've actually got a decent pace with the other character, or other party members at least. I catch he's just... He's just already up there. Like, he's got five more to go before he's maxed out. Cause I'm a shapeshifter. I spell masquerade. Hiding bold face and mind. I'm ruining the song and I feel bad. Uh... Alright, so we can go take care of Kawakami first. Wait, do I have a temperance persona? Yeah, I got Biako. So, yeah, let's just hang out with Kawakami. Uh, are you perhaps with Jamara-san? Mm. That voice wasn't Kawakami. Maybe you should ask for more details? Uh, who's this? If they had a nurse at Aoyama Hospital speaking on the behalf of Kawakami-san, Kawakami has actually collapsed and she's been admitted to our hospital. Do you know our hospital's address? Her, her room number is... Mm. This isn't good. Let's over there right away. Jeez. I'm just a little overworked. No need to make a big deal out of it. Um, but thanks for coming all the way to uh, visit me. Uh, how could I collapse at a time like this? I need to make some money. How am I going to make today's payment? Tch, there you are. <laughs> what are you doing, Miss Kawakami? I called the school, but no one answered. What? Takase-san. You contacted the school? Well, you weren't answering your phone. And when I and when I thought you finally answered, it was a nurse who told us you were here. It was really inconvenient for us that you, when you miss a payment, you know. No, no, it's not like she wanted to collapse. But our credit card payment is coming up soon, so we'll need you to transfer the money. I'm, I'm sorry. These are Takasa Kun's guardians. The ones that I mentioned the other day. They took care of him. Who's this? He's one of my students. He came to visit me. Messing around with another student, huh? Ha! You never learn, do you? Man, for all you did to him. I'm sorry. So, when are you gonna be able to transfer the money? I should be able to send it out by tomorrow. Don't pay them. Uchimaru-kun? Stay out of this! Don't act tough, kid. Our precious adoptive son, Ta Taiki, uh, died because of this woman. 
Honestly, she should have been fired. Ugh. That's not... And yet, she still doesn't know her place, and she continues to teach. We're gonna need you to show some remorse for what you did to him. In a material and undeniable way. I understand. I will pay you. So, it's not like we're trying to extort you. But who was it who convinced Taiki to start studying when he needed to be working? The school work on top of his part-time job overwhelmed him, which led him to the accident. Poor Taiki, it's almost as if he was murdered. So you're no longer feeling feel regret. In that case, perhaps we should go to the board. Uh, sue, we should sue the board of education, or rather, we have a chat with your school. Either way, your days as a teacher will be over, and we, we'll be looking forward to receiving your payment. <sighs> I have to figure out how to make more money. I guess transferring to our sister company is the only way. Uh, think through this more. I can't believe I'm getting scolded by my student. Why? Why are you so interested in helping me? I'm not worth it. <laughs> you know what? I'm gonna stop worrying about it. The money, I'll pay it. I'll do everything my everything master tells me to do. Meow. I'm so tired. All I really want is to, a way to apologize to Kasekun. So, if his guardians, guardians demand money, then I have to pay them. Uh, so little, little, little thing here, because I think I mentioned this before. Uh, this is just straight up extortion. This is not paying back your dues. You're being extorted by them using the guilt and also blackmailing your ass for something that happened fucking years ago. Like, that shit was not your fucking fault. The school basically forced you to stop t tutoring him, and his guardians should have fucking not made him do part-time work if he was going to be getting tutoring so he can get better at fucking school. So, at the end of the day, it's the fucking parents' fault? Or the guardians? Just rest for now. Sorry, I'm not quite back at 100% yet, so my thoughts are all over the place. I'm gonna get some rest. I appreciate you coming to visit me today. It made me really happy. I feel that Kawakami is starting to depend on me. All right. <coughs> I'll be releasing. I'll be released first thing tomorrow, so don't worry. The IVs work really well. Visiting hours are over. I'll see you later then. Get home safe, okay? Well then. Today's the day we're having Futaba try and help out at the cafe, right? And this would be a stressful turn of events. Yeah, you didn't have to pay this time. Did you want me to let Futaba help out around the shop? But I've never had her do anything like that before. Is she gonna be okay? No. Uh, experience is important. Still, putting her out in front of customers is a little much. D don't worry, I did graduate middle school last year. I'll be fine if I just think of this as my first summer job of high school. Well, in that case, uh, how about you wash the dishes? Just don't push yourself too hard, okay? <coughs> hey, are you all right? The usual, boss. Extra strong. Uh, sure thing. Keep an eye on Futaba for me. You okay? Oui, oui. <laughs> That's French, not Japanese. She a new part timer. Man, smooth as always. What number Bond girl is this, boss? It's not like that. Also, wait, wait, hold on. What number Bond girl is that? You know, there's a social link joke to make, but I'm not gonna make it. You usually go for the older ones, right? It's only natural you'd want someone younger sometimes. Okay, this is getting a little it's creepy. It's like the Guatemala Peaberry coffee. 
Its acidic sweetness is akin to a breath of fresh air. Nigga, this is kind of creepy considering Sojiro's like, I think 30 to 40 years old and Futaba's like 17 to 16 years old. So that's like a huge yikes, man. Sorry, we're serving a blend today. Hey, snap out of it. Hurry up and bring in the coffee before it gets cold. <gasps> Yo, here's your coffee. When in the world did she... Hey, Futaba, haven't I told you not to show up in front of people with that damn thing on? And... And be more polite when you're bringing something to a customer. Here's your coffee, sir. Oh, thanks. Did you see? I did my job right! You did great. Huh. Turns out this is pretty easy. To think Futaba would go out and talk to a customer herself. Mask aside, I'm impressed. Looks like people really can change. Sojiro, want me to bring coffee to more customers? N mask off first. Oh, I'll think about it. Yeah, like, QB, they voiced all three days, and I don't even think the first three days were even voiced originally. So, like, the three days with Futaba, did anyone share information about our identities? But, like, hell we do that. Why the question? I ever heard someone saying in the city that they, they're our acquaintance. Talk about false rumors. But, hey, at least we're famous enough to have rumors about us. We might even break into the news online, or maybe TV. Yeah, if we get caught. Well, yeah. By the way, how did, how did today go? I served coffee to customers. She did good. Uh, she was wearing a mask, though. So she showed up in front of customers with that thing on. Anyways, you better get used to it fast. You can't be a phantom thief if you get scared of people. I'm trying my best. We're on a roll. Futaba's been working really hard. And then there's Ryuji. It's like I don't it look like he doesn't even have a care in the world. <sighs> it's gonna be trouble somewhere down the line if he keeps this up. Even Morgana points out that Ryuji is way too focused on fucking fame. Yeah, it's so like Futaba's like a year younger than you. And... She's just shorter than usual. So, Kawakami's not available. Oh, yes, available. Uh, today is... What day is it? 25th. Perfect. Okay, first off, what I'm gonna do... Uh, I have a thing I need to do. So, first off, doing this. Uh, huh? What the hell is this? Hanami Cherry Blossom? I guess it's supposed to be Blossom? Because that's the only thing I can think of when it comes to uh, Cherry Blossom viewing. Also, every anime on the fucking planet uses that damn thing. Guess it's Blossom? Better be. Yeah. Blossom. Notice flower watching in English. Hanami is an old Japanese tradition of viewing the cherry blossoms and enjoying the arrival of spring. The flower, mentioned in traditional Japanese poetry, actually refers to the plum flower. It's said that cherry blossoms overtook the usage during the Heian period. Alright. Alright. Wow, I couldn't even figure that one out. Nice. And maybe a little bit smarter after solving those crossword puzzles. Please don't fuck up like a lion, dude. I don't, I don't know about that one, Chief. Alright, so... Hey. No, 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 wait. Do we have... Do we have, uh... Hmm. Son of a bitch. Fine, I'll have Kawakami make the fucking coffee. Hmm. Yep. Make sure you close up. Huh? Wait, Rob's already on Futaba? 
Wait, how the fuck did he get the Futaba already? Wasn't he on like Madarame a while ago? Like, pretty sure he was on Madarame a minute, a little bit ago. I was about to say, how the fuck did he end up on, uh... Like, how the fuck did he end up at, uh... At Futaba already? Son of a bitch. Alright, so we're gonna just have to go to Kichi Joju. No, cause, like, I'm getting confused cause chat's over here saying, Oh! Uh, don't fuck up like Rob did, and then Scarlet's talking about how, like, Ro uh, Rob is on Futaba already. And I'm like, how the oh, fuck is he already on Futaba, or Futaba? That motherfucker just got the game a while ago. Hey. Uh, if we're going speed and luck, we're gonna go with, probably, uh, Makoto again. Oh. Uh, yeah. Hmm. Hey, thanks for coming in. Uh, you can sit down anyway. Yeah, whatever. Please tell me that. Yeah, so live singer right there. This song is still Not lit. Bad at all. <laughs> oh, there's a singer here. Oh uh, yeah. This song, I still love this song. This song is calming as fuck. <laughs> uh, it's really different when you hear a piece when performed live. And that's apparently supposed to be the, uh, that's supposed to be Lin. Uh, the one who sings like most of the Persona 5 songs. Uh, this is good, okay. Uh, she, she does the same shit, alright. You're right. I am the fool or what not. I do not regret with my choices. Alright, Makoto. Feel a little more mature. Boost. Spending time in uh, spending time in the jazz club has had an effect on Makoto's heart. Alright. What the fuck? Thank Hold you. on. No. All right. Where, where's my boost? Are they supposed to get a boost when it, or uh, EXP boost? I guess the boosts are random. Hi. Uh, yeah, the trailers played a lot of the new, newer songs for Royal, specifically uh, Lin tracks and shit. So it doesn't really surprise me knowing that Atlas has a bad habit of accidentally spoiling shit. Like, basically how they spoiled that, yeah, you, yo, Ketchy's not actually dead, nigga. Apparently, from what the trailer showed. I'm not gonna go deep on how what the trailer showed, because I don't want to think about it, but, you know, you get my point. Oh my god, my eyes. Well then. Ugh. Let's see, our plans for today are, huh? Did we have nothing planned? I'm out shopping with Makoto. We'll head over there, I'll head over when we're done. Honestly, I wanted to bring Futaba along with us. We can't just take her into crowns like that, though. It'd be way too soon. Sometimes drastic measures, or drastic measures are necessary. Uh, such pr uh, spiky words. You know you need to come. You need. You know you need to do this someday, right? Actually, Queen's clothes don't have a lot of spikes too. They'll probably pierce my hand if I touch them. I have honestly considered that possibility as well. <laughs> Not you too, Yusuke. Hey, this sounds like fun. I want to join in. We're all we're talking to Futaba. This doesn't involve you. Note, on is called a Ryuji. Don't take notes on this. Anyways, look forward to when we're coming over. My heart is cut. Hmm. Hmm. So, what are they scheming? Hiding by the veils of miles.
Shit, my bad. Hold up. Fuck. Uh, today's the fourth day already, and you're getting better with people. Blah, blah, blah. People cannot change their deep-seated habits that easily. Well, let's just say you've made some progress for now. No! Stop it! You're gonna blow my cheeks off! Man, those girls are late. What do they think they are making us wait like this? Hello. Please excuse us. Apologies for the lateness. We were looking at multiple items and weren't sure which to choose. Looking? Looking at what? A swimsuit, of course. For Futaba-chan. The swimsuit? Yo, where'd y'all get Futaba three sizes, though? <clears throat> Like legit, where did y'all get Futaba's three sizes, nigga? Like y'all, y'all out here. Mm. See, I would say more, but I don't want this shit used to be used against me to incriminate my ass. Look, I'm already black. I already got enough problems as it is with America. You don't have one, do you? No, but okay. Let's have you try it on right now, then. No, 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 now. You can't go to the beach if you don't have a good-fitting swimsuit. You're talking to... Okay. I feel like this is taking a jab at me, because when I go to the beach, you know, when Florida's not filled with dumbass spring breakers, um, I'm usually that one guy who, um, who tends to, uh, what is it? I tend to, uh, what is it? I guess I tend to wear, like, I, at, at best, maybe shorts and a jacket. That's basically it. Hold on. I wonder what Futaba's three sizes are. FBI, open up! <laughs> we don't have much time left, you know. Uh, but... You know what'll happen if you try and look, right? It's called going to jail. Well, technically, Yusuke would go to jail, because I think Yusuke's older than the other two. I wouldn't go to jail, what? Actually, I would go to jail on the counts of stalking and sexual harassment. Ryuji sexual harassment, uh, Yusuke uh, invasion. I don't fucking know. Why am I contemplating the fucking court cases or the fucking court uh, system or charges that would be going against them if they peeked on Futaba naked? Why am I now thinking about this shit? This <laughs> uh, I should not. I should not be drinking at like. Six, I should not be drinking this early in the morning. You were able to eyeball it with such accuracy on. I know, right? There we go. It's on. What the? This barely covers anything. That's normal for a swimsuit. Now, we just need to push these a little more this way. Yeah. <sighs> oh, hold on. Push. Are you supposed to move them with that much force? Oh my god. Gotta put some oomph into this stuff. <laughs> there. Whoa, even I'm impressed. I wonder what they're doing up there. They're having her try on the swimsuit, right? What else could they be doing? Also, I just realized something. Why are y'all doing it in my room? What if I had camera set up or something? Why not do it in the fucking bathroom or something? But no, y'all motherfuckers are doing that uh, in my room. Okay, I just realized that. Taba in his swimsuit, hmm? You skate down, boy. I suspect that would make a great painting. Perhaps we should ask Makoto about it. Makoto would send their asses to jail faster than uh, Harvey Weinstein. Like, uh, I don't think... I don't think draw... Okay. Like... Yusuke, 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 you're a cool dude, but shut the fuck up. We would go to jail. We would go to jail. We're all, like, or either that or Juvie. Yeah, and go for it, Ryuji. <laughs> Me? I humbly request you do so as well. Hell no! You guys are such children. 
What's with all the ruckus upstairs? Something about a swimsuit? Yeah, we're going to the beach pretty soon, so they're trying some swimsuits out. Futaba's going to the beach. I didn't think I'd ever see her take that much interest in going outside again. Well then, it seems we're good to go with the swimsuit. All flattery aside, I think it looks really great. Now you just gotta get rid of those round shoulders. Come on, straighten out your back. We're right. She might be some trouble, but I hope she can make some great memories with you guys. Okay, we got some Susan Jolie getting the beach. They're dangerous either way. Get, like some nudes. Nice. Chief had some high expectations of us. We need to work harder to help Futaba make uh, good memories. I'm a shapeshifter. Nice. I'm a masquerade. Hiding both face and mine. Oh no. Uh, it's time. Hold on. I think it's time for Kawakami. Yep. We're probably gonna mix up Kawakami by the end of this at this point. Oh. Hi. I'm Becky, Gorilla Maid of the Main World. And the type of work depends on how. Oh, it's you. Does your room need cleaning, or did you just want me to cook for you? I can provide all sorts of services. Um, there's stuff I need to talk to you about. So, would you request me? I feel like, yeah, fuck it. Hello, Biako. This is why I keep you around, dude. I'll head over no, they haven't saw him. By this point, they keep hearing uh, about the black uh, black mask uh, metaverse user. Like, we're just about to start Okuma right as summer ends. I'm heading over right away then, so please wait for me, master. You know, it feels really bad being the black guy hey, saying master hey. a lot. I don't know, the mayor is just me. I actually really like the uh, antique feel of this room, but I have to say goodbye to it today. Um. Thing is, I decided to quit. My boss found me a part-time job that pays better than this one. The Kasekun's guardians keep increasing their demands, so it's, this is just what I have to do. Please reconsider, or is this really what you want? What I want. The Kasekun's guardians only say, are only say the only true way to apologize to Kasekun is by paying them. If that's not true, then what's the right thing to do here? I wonder if I can escape all this if I quit being a teacher. People like me have no right of being a teacher. If I quit on my own, I won't have to pay them. That's why I'm going to be quitting both my teaching job and my maid job. What do you think? I need my teacher. Heh. <sighs> you always seem to make things about you. If I could only follow my own path like you do. Now that I think about it, it's too late for me to stop being a teacher. If I, if I really felt bad about for, for what happened, I would have resigned the day he died. And yet, I still feel like there's a need to teach. I wonder why I feel that way even now. That's your answer. Uchimaru. Oh, that's right. I decided the way to apologize to make sure that it won't ever happen to another student like him. Because I might have been able to save him if, it was, if I hadn't been afraid of rumors or labels back then. I wanted to become a teacher who takes care of her students. And that's the mindset I've had. But now, I spend all my free time at part-time jobs just so I can continue working as a teacher. 
I put critical work of the teacher on the back burner so I could make make apology money. And that's where it all went wrong. I can't make things right with Takasa Kun like this. Mistakes can be fixed. I'll be the teacher I aspire to be. That way, that's the right way for me to make amends with, Taka, with Takase Kun. From here on, I refuse to pay them any more money. And that's my answer. Well, what do you think? Be confident in your answer. You're right. You're right. <laughs> well, oh, fuck. <laughs> oh my god. Um, we will show you the way. Uh, you can't get the right answer from someone else. It can only be found within. I've learned that from you. In a way, you, you're my teacher. <laughs> uh, just kidding. Alright. I've been so worried about making money that I haven't been paying attention to my students. Especially to you. I avert my eyes from from you because you you were labeled just like Takasa Kun was, but from now on, I'm going to protect you too as your teacher, and I'll never betray you. I want to protect you. That kind of line only works from somebody old enough to handle his own household chores. But thanks, I'll speak with the Takases. I'm not going to run anymore. Everything should be fine as long as I talk to them face to face. All right, time for me to go. Thanks. Thank you. See you later. Good night. Wait, we don't get to do the mementos quest? Wait, are Mementos Quest rank 8 or rank 9? Because we didn't get Mishima's uh, Mementos Request, so who fucking knows? So what should we do today? Let's see. Want to eat together? You know, like how we had Hot Pot that one time. That may be a good idea. It'll be a great way to strengthen our intra-squad friendships. I, I can do that. Okay, I'll take a cola and an omelet with rice. Oh, and make that a large, please. I'd like the same. Do you have the money? No, but this is for Futaba's sake. <sighs> Fine. You owe me, got it? Okay, so it seems like, yeah, so that's another thing I noticed. Because Mishima doesn't have a Mementos quest either. So, I think they removed some Mementos quests. So you don't have to do them to do a social link anymore. I want the same, extra large. Ah, I ate loads. Damn, Futaba, I'm impressed. Indeed, your appetite is quite nice to see. I much prefer that to women who don't eat a lot. You better not be hitting on me. Ah. Uh, <laughs> How rude. How to get arrested if I. Sojiro, help me! Will you stop that? So does this mean our training's going good? I think so. Let's go with that then. Hey, let me make you guys some after meal coffee. It's on me. Thank you. I want iced cocoa! You can't handle bitter stuff either, right? Iced cocoa sound good? Yeah, definitely. Extra cold, please. <laughs> I don't think we've ever had a lunch this lively. Mm -hmm. It's lots of fun. You know, I just thought about this. Nana, er, Futaba is basically just a dateable version of Nanako. Oh. 
Looks like we know when we'll actually finish up now. The beach is finally within reach. Where have I been? No, but I see your point. Well, I'm just saying it's like okay. the little sister character that's attached to the main character after helping with either some kind of trauma or parental problems and whatnot. And at least this time it's, you know, not with an actual child, so... Wait, what? Kamikami's locked off. What? Wait, 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 wait. Why is Kamikami grayed out? Uh, so I don't remember Kawakami's route that well, so am I just straight up locked out of her coffin on? Alright, who's available then? EY's not available. Hifumi's available. Uh, before we do anything else, though... Actually, no, no, no. We're not gonna hang out with Hifumi. We're gonna go to the theater. Because we need to increase our kindness if we want to hang out with Futaba, so... We're gonna have to do this today. Because I think this movie goes away by the end of the week. And I know... I think some people did bring up that uh, Kawakami's... Oh. It was him! He stole the silverware! He even stole the candlesticks! Thief! Confess your crime! Oh! Is there no god in this world? What is a... What is a human? But... <laughs> oh my god. I want to make Castlevania tricks, but I've never played Castlevania. The Bishop guy is too much. He should cut... He should cut the other guy some slack. I feel like I was able to learn about how to be more compassionate to others. Please, I'm gonna increase my fucking, uh... Empathetic. There we fucking right. go. Uh... We even watched... Yeah, yeah, it's, uh, it's in the credits. Head. Don't give a shit. I think it activates after Futaba joins. I'm actually curious. If I go to Mementos, will I get Futaba? Okay. Now, one more day we'll go to the beach. Hey there. I need help with the dishes. No! No! What the fuck? Stop stealing my daytime shit! Want anything, Futaba? Orange juice. 100% natural. That reminds me, you're going to the beach tomorrow, yeah? Go have fun, and make up for the fireworks. Just try not to cut loose too much. Fireworks? Oh, yeah, you wouldn't know. He tried to go to a firework festival, but it got rained out. Not only did he get crushed in the crowd, but he came home looking like some kind of drowned rat. Fireworks, huh? Hello. Oh, hi, Ketchy. Oh, welcome. Oh, you're... Oh, this is when he starts coming to LeBlanc more often. Huh? You know each other? Wait, aren't you... I'm Akechi. Oh, yeah, the one on TV and stuff. So what brings you here, Mr. Detective? This place is more than I imagined it to be. The atmosphere is wonderful. No wonder Sai san recommended it so strongly to me. <laughs> I already told her everything I know. There's nothing more I've got for you people. Oh, no. That's not my intention. I just came to enjoy some coffee. Oh. And she is? Oh. You must be Wakaba Ishiki's. What'll it be? I'll have whatever you recommend. Coming right up. Huh. It seems I'm unwelcome no matter where I go. It's not, uh, it's not just here? Oh, wow. Can't you have character? Holy shit. Did I bother you? 
My apologies. Apparently, my mother was in a relationship with some lowlife of a man. She was swiftly discarded when he learned she was pregnant. That despair would lead to her death. Eh, sounds like a certain somebody I know. Thanks to him, I was passed from foster home to foster home. But I do quite well by myself these days. Mm. Ah, yes, Mejed. To think they'd be taken down by another hacker. I'm not sure whether Mejed was defeated by the Phantom Thieves themselves, or an avid supporter. Um, you're... Futaba-chan, right? Sai-san told me about you. Many kids your age seem to be fans of the Phantom Thief. Do you like them too? <laughs> What's the matter? You're popular too, Ace Detective Akechi. <laughs> Thank you. Although I'd rather not be compared to people like the Phantom Thieves, if at all possible. Hmm. This is delicious. You get to drink this coffee every day? I'm incredibly jealous. I would never have thought you'd be boarding at this cafe. We seem to share some kind of bond. I agree. <laughs> Thank you. I believe that fate brings people together. It's strange, but talking to you is thought-provoking. Well, I think I found my go-to cafe. Fucking stole my fucking morning, you asshole. Coming out right now. I'm on Silent Blanc. Wanna light fireworks? Can we? I bought some. You went by yourself? Mm-hmm. I ran into Mona on the way back though. I'll go get Sojiro. I was worried, so I decided to follow her. She was able to buy everything on her own, though. If she can do that, she should be good to go. Plus, she did a great job dodging that ace detective. Sojiro, hurry, hurry! We're gonna have a firework festival! Oh, hold on, Futaba. I, I haven't even put on my cigarette yet. <laughs> Come on! Don't get the smoke on me! Super double move! Whee! God. Will you listen to... <laughs> hey, the, the cat doesn't like the smoke. Keep the flames away from him. Dang! I made a huge one! Sojiro, look! Look! <laughs> right. It's just be careful, okay? <laughs> Memories of summer, huh? Okie dokie. I'm gonna do ten now! No! no! <laughs> <laughs> I mean, most people think of you as a toy, so... Make sure you keep an eye on her. It's tough enough going solo, let alone watching over someone else. Still, going to enjoy the beach. We can finally have a good time. Yeah, yeah, you don't really, you don't, well, in general, uh, you don't want to deal with uh, smoke inhalation. Or, uh, or smoke inhalation. What? Whatever you want to fucking call it, I think. Oh, right, I have a shit ton of blank cards. Long speech today. Do not give a fuck. Where, Kawakami, please. Kawakami, baby, no! Baby girl, no! Hiding both bears and mine. That's incredible. How can I help you? Damn it, you don't have any new books. Yeah. Damn it, old man. Uh, let's just go to the, uh... I'm gonna regret this, I know it. Oh. What do you wanna do? Uh let's go increase our charm today. <sighs> then 
the mint bath is warming me up. Demonetized. There we go. So now I can go hang out at Lala Chant's bar at night. So now I can actually do that uh, one request that uh, that Mishima gave me. Utaba will be in your care today. Make sure you don't let any dudes try to hit on her. I won't leave her side. Good. As long as you understand, I'll be counting on you. So, you don't want me letting dudes hit on her, but am I allowed to? <laughs> hey, can we go already? Can somebody check and see what rank of kindness I have to be with Futaba? Is it rank 3 or rank 4? Are you sure you'll be alright? It's just a day trip. Don't underestimate me. Uh, right. Uh, sorry. Guess I just have to let it go. Have fun, but... Be careful, you two. Son of a bitch, it's rank four. Wait, uh, hey, my wife, we can finally hang out with Progress Makoto. Oh, uh, well, oh, wait, and QB's like, bruh. <laughs> hey, I mean, he said keep the guys off, or he didn't say keep me off of her. Okay, that sounds really bad, ignore what I just said. I still ain't got no ass. Demonetize, copyright oh, strikes, and so and copyright hard. claims. There's a lot of people here. Are you? I'm fine. You guys are here. It's almost lunchtime. No, the squid's staring at me. It's cooked, so don't worry. Would you even eat squid if I'm not around? Why don't we eat lunch too? I'll go get some stuff for us then. You're eating that even here? My staple food. This should be a familiar flavor. Yet how does it taste so good? What's up, Makoto? You ain't eating much. Uh, oh, um... Not feeling well or something? You just don't get it, do you, Ryuji? When a girl's in a swimsuit, she wants to look as slim as possible. Hey, yo. You can't say that anymore. It's 20... It's 2020. You gotta be thick. Still, you're worrying too much. Did you make sure to eat breakfast? Mona lacks tact. So, what do we do now? Should we play some beach volleyball? Oh, sorry. Us girls already made plans to ride a banana boat. We could only rent a three-person one. Sorry. Wait, then what about us? Keep an eye on our stuff. Uh, hell no. Why you gotta treat us like that? Trust me, Ryuji. Uh, tr you will get. You will learn <laughs> uh, in the ways of marriage and dealing dealing with your girlfriend. You might want to kind of do what they say sometimes, or at least watch their shit. 
Cause, uh, yeah, you don't want to piss off the girl who can probably kick your ass. We're celebrities making headlines. You should treat us better. I do think they're not bad in the metaverse, but in reality, strange, isn't it? Uh, they can steal treasures, but they don't seem like they can steal a girl's heart at all. Uh, are you sure about that? But, Lady On, can we get to the banana boat already? Oh, sorry. why? Uh, why is Mutaba so much shorter than the other girls? Oh boy, uh, hmm, hmm. I forgot how short Futaba is compared to everyone else. We'll switch when we're done. Keep an eye on our stuff for us. Banana, banana. Uh, I don't get how amazing we are. We risk our lives being phantom thieves. There's no way we're the same as other guys around here. Ryuji, should we be having more good times in reality too? You're full of yourself. No, we're special. Don't you agree, Yusuke? Well, if you put it that way, you may be right. On and the others don't get it because they're always around us. Hey, how do we get Lady On to notice how amazing we are as phantom thieves? Well, we gotta steal, you know what? Uh, hearts. On made fun of us and all. Let's show her what we're really made of. Oh no. I see. Oh no. I just need to prove my skills in reality. Oh well. no. Operation Babe Hunt 2.0. Here's the problem though, and I'm gonna say this right now because for all you do to think about doing this, don't do it. Like, here's my thing. It's okay going flirt or whatever. Go do whatever. Here's the thing. Don't do it when you're hanging out with other girls. Like, it's not even that it's like, oh, it's misogynistic or whatever, or sexist or whatever the shit. The, this is just bad because, like, that's just rude. Like, that's just fucking rude. Like, dude, you're out here hanging with us, but you're over here trying to get laid. Let's steal all the hearts with the skills we've honed as Phantom Thieves. I'm this sure fuck. will be all over us considering the vibes we give off. Very well. Let's do this. Pulling off our work in reality doesn't sound bad. It's settled then. So, Mona, you're in charge of watching over our stuff, okay? Huh? All right, let's hurry up and go. Hey, what the hell? Get back here! Don't leave me behind! Oh no. Sorry, Ryuji, you didn't max out your charisma. You didn't max out your charm. Ramen, you didn't. Er, no. Ooh, nigga, you better run. Y'all niggas should have ran. just looks kind of bland to me just give up dude come on it ain't over yet I'm going for a miracle comeback hmm. did someone follow us here something tells me we're being watched really oh. you think one of those girls changed her mind OMG it's the golden boy himself oh no <laughs> Oh, it's gonna be... <gasps> and he's already got his own little entourage. <laughs> we really did teach him right, didn't we? Um. You? Oh, no. So, yeah. <laughs> so, yeah, they were, uh... Yeah. If I remember correctly, yeah, they're no longer gay stereotypes. They're just drag queens. What are you guys doing here? Sometimes we just gotta get out of the city, forget the nightlife, breathe fresh air, enjoy some eye candy. 
We thought we lost our protege. Who would have guessed our vacay was actually the call of fate? Oh, what's with the look? <laughs> Don't believe in fate? Or did you really not have fun last time? Uh, that sounds a little rapey, but okay. You gonna tell us you saw yourself in all that chiffon and felt nothing? Uh, I don't think I, I felt what you guys were hoping. Oh, honey, I get it. Everyone's nervous when they first start out. But trust me, you'll make their jaws drop. Just an hour at the vanity, three hours at the boutique, and we can just pick up where we left off last time. So, are you ready to steal some hearts? Uh, we gotta go, sorry! Was it something I said? Oh, what a tragedy. Another starlet slips through our fingers. <laughs> I don't think... No, no more makeovers. <sighs> you know, I just realized, did they... Oh, uh, hold on. By the way, where's Yusuke? So this is where you two were. I've been searching for you. Uh, what are you doing with those lobsters? While you were busy with your interrogation, I found these beautiful specimens on sale. And so I decided to spend the last of my money on them. Man, you're real hopeless when it comes to cash. Wait, you were watching us? Why didn't you help? Apologies, but I was entranced. The moment I set eyes on this distinct shape, I was in love. I haven't had my very core shaken as vigorously as this since the first time An entered my gaze. Good for you. We're here with friends. Come on, don't lie to us, baby. How about you come for a nice cruise on our boat? There's going to be a party, too. Tons of celebrities and industry people will be coming along. Are you even listening to us? Sorry about the wait. Huh, so... We were serious about being here with friends. That's what we've been saying from the start. Don't you find it boring spending your time with kids like them? It's far more interesting than anything involving you two. What was that? Hey, let's just let the children have fun with fellow children. We'll be going now. <sighs> what creeps? Thanks for coming in like that. Those guys just wouldn't stop pestering us. They got lucky. What do you mean? If things had gone bad, you would have just sent them to the hospital. Uh, never mind. It's nothing. By the way, where are Futaba and Morgana? Ooh, are those lobsters? One in each hand. I was wondering about that myself. Are you going to make them into sashimi? Or perhaps roast them whole? You know, I would love to fantasize about lobster, but I'm allergic to lobster. Enough of your vile postulations. These are purely for the sake of visual appreciation. We did tons of stuff today. All in all, I guess coming to the beach was pretty worth it. 